Hello and welcome to another video tutorial from ComputerGaga.com. This tutorial will look at using the data entry form in Excel 2010. Now the data entry form is a fantastic feature of Excel that makes it easy to add new records and edit existing records of a database or a table. Now in Excel 2010 Microsoft decided to remove this button from the ribbon making it difficult to find and for some uh, believing that it's not available anymore. So I'm often asked where is the data entry form in Excel 2010. Well fortunately it does still exist but it will need to be added to a toolbar or ribbon to make it accessible. So let's look at doing that first of all. Uh, if I want to add it to my quick access toolbar at the top I can click on the customize quick access toolbar button come into more commands from the list of popular commands that Excel provide here I can change popular commands to commands not on the ribbon scroll down to the form control in this alphabetical list and add it onto the toolbar and I'll click on OK to save those changes so the form is now available to use the form just click anywhere in your in your data list in your table click the form button and you'll get a very user friendly uh, data form showing me my 799 records and allowing me to skip through each one in order and you can see it's just skipping through the list in the background there uh, to search for specific records using the criteria button here and typing in maybe an order number to find that sp specific record or even to use multiple criteria to find a particular order there we go, 2004 and it finds that particular order which I can then make additions to and save finally another great feature of this entry tool is to add new records if I click on the new button to add a new record it will automatically add this record to the bottom of my list saving me the issue of having to scroll to the bottom and, and find the, the first empty row in order to do such a change. If I click on close here and scroll to the bottom uh, you will see my new order added to the next empty row. This makes data entry and, uh, and additions to, to existing records an absolute breeze in Excel. That is the data entry form. Uh, I hope you enjoyed your tutorial. Thank you for watching and please check out some of our other tutorials at computergaga.com.